Thank you, YouTube. Search for Forest Federation. Watch on your big screen. Or another device if you're at home. Get yourself comfy. This could take a while. What a happy scene. Something new every day for your long term memory. This is so exciting. It is nearly time for a forest assembly. It's Monday everyone and welcome to the Forest Federation, Newton Primary School and Stukeley Meadows Primary School together as one in the forest. This is our last full week. We are here next week for three days, but this is our last full week before we break for Christmas and there is so much going on. I hope you're ready to hear about it. Six short words to drive our lives. Every day in our schools, we want children and staff to feel be, become, our school motto is, our school curriculum is. Okay, everyone, not much time. Let's go straight into talking about what's happening this week. <music> Okay, at Stukeley Meadows this week, we've got foundation stage, Juniper and Rowan, you're dress rehearsing, and then you're doing your nativity show to families. I think that's on Tuesday or Wednesday, gonna be fantastic. That's also happening at Newton. We're dress rehearsing at Juniper class, we're practicing to with the school, and then families after school on Tuesday are gonna see the nativity show, and we cannot wait to see both of those. It's gonna be great. Also happening this week at both schools, um, at Stukeley this week, on Thursday, 2.30, we're doing 12 Days of Stukeley. It's our famous song, Mrs. Page absolutely loves it. It's our, it's our annual song, 12 Days of Stukeley. We're all in the hall, gonna have a great time. Um, at Newton, we're also doing 12 Days of Newton. We did that last year, remember? In fact, did we do it two years? Anyway, um, that's gonna be in the hall on Thursday, but that's also part of a sharing assembly. All the families are coming in. I hope they're all gonna come in. We've got Christmas songs, Christmas poems, Christmas dancing. I've joked about dancing. 12 Days is uh, Newton, it's going to be fantastic. Um, also, at uh, Newton, you're going to the church this week on Wednesday afternoon for the Christmas church service. You've been practicing really hard for that. And also, if it wasn't Christmassy enough, we have also got this week, we will be practicing with me and singing our Federation Christmas tune. It's going to be Winter Wonderland but actually not Winter Wonderland. It's gonna be different lyrics, just like people appreciate from me. Yes, they do. Okay, that's it this week, loads going on. Quick homework reminder, read, write, quiz, spell, calculate. You know the drill, you've got another full week to crack on. Well done to everyone who's committed to that and doing the right thing. Um, now we're gonna move on to um, Playtime Challenge. Grab a rope, a bat or ball, skittles or nothing at all, everybody's heard the call, this is the playtime challenge. Grab a rope, a bat or ball, skittles or nothing at all, everybody's heard the call, this is the playtime challenge. Okay, last week it was the balancing. I said, get a bat, get anything and balance. Now, I talked to Mr. Watley, and he said the trick when you're balancing is to always look at the top of what you're doing. And uh, this is unbelievable. I am looking at the... Mr. Watley's absolutely right. Look at the top of what you're balancing, not the bottom. That's incredible, Mr. Watley, brilliant. Anyway, let's have a look at all the incredible balancing that happened. Newton, I've got to just say, Newton, come on. We have staff outside, we can get footage. I really need Newton to get stuck into this because we've got some very talented sportsmen and women and boys and girls. Anyway, uh, watch out for the balancing in both of our schools, kind of, mainly Stukeley, this week.
well done to everyone who did the balancing. I'm very impressed. Now, this is our last playtime challenge before the Christmas break, and it's a two-person challenge. You need one person stood this way and another person with their back to them. So you're going to have two people. Now, if you're going to get a video of this, the video needs to be with both people back to back. OK, anyway, two people back to back. One person has a ball. You got it. So one person back. This person throws the ball over their head and this person needs to catch it. That's it. Both people back to back. One throws over their head. The other person has to catch it. Can we get videos of that? Who can do it the best? I'm going to give it a go just like this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, great. Anyway, two people throw over the head throw. The other person catches. Get it on bit. Get it on video, send it in to me please, and we've got our Playtime Challenges. Right, from Playtime Challenge to Creative Challenge. Now at the end of this video, the end of this video, we've got the Stupidly Creative Challenge, which was the writing challenge. Newton, I didn't get enough photos of you children with their favorite things. So um, it's a shame, I, mean, I try and push for it. I don't want to give you too much to do, but I really need them in. Anyway, at the end of this video, the Stupidly Creative Challenge, there's the Festive EDK, which I know you're excited about. But the challenge this week for both schools, and I know that Newton can smash this so can Stupidly, we want photos of your festive lights, your Christmas trees, your decorations. So we want photos of your lights outside of your house, photos of your lights on your tree. It'll be great to get you in the photos as well. Can we have a photo of you stood outside your house with all your twinkly lights? Or you are in front of your tree. Come on, we want festive pictures. Also, if you celebrate Diwali, Festival of Light, that's another opportunity to get your photos in. Anything with celebration lights would be great. Newton can definitely do this. Get your Christmas tree pics in at least. Stupidly, absolutely on it. Send them in. Enjoy the videos at the end. Have a great week. Work hard, be kind, aim high. You know it.